Hi children, I'm your friend, I'm Adepoju David. Um, I'm making this video for Caregivers Child Foundation. I'm very happy to speak with you. you. You are very precious to our society. We are the future that we seek in, in our world. You know, don't let anybody put you down. You are very important. You, you have most part of your life still ahead of you to live. So you, 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 you are lucky. Let me congratulate you for being young because it's an opportunity for you to maximize all the potentials inside of you. It doesn't matter the situation around you actually because your background doesn't have anything to do with the future you desire. If you can make deliberate decisions right from this young age, you know, uh, you're not too young to make decisions, good decisions that would, you know, shape your future into a glorious one. Um, let me quickly say that it doesn't matter the situation around you right now. It's not impossible that you don't even know your parents, you don't have um, the emotional support from your parents, the parental care is not there. Don't worry, we've, we've had many people that made success in our society without even parental care. So it's all about your personal decision. So you're not too young, you don't have to worry. And then it doesn't matter whether you, are, whether you are attending a private school or a public school. That is not a matter here. I was in, in a public school for my secondary education for six years. Even though I, I did not make my paper once, I failed more than five times. But let me tell you that I eventually passed. Life is, is a race. You just take your lane, you know. So it's... Um, it doesn't matter whether you don't have the money or you don't have the financial support to go to the, the, the supposed good private schools around. In that public school, you can, you can study on your own, you can go for extramural classes, you can, you can make the success that you, really, you have really been dreaming about, you know. So don't worry about uh, the situation that surrounds you. And I want you to know that exam is not a true test of brilliancy. I knew I was brilliant, but I was failing my exams, you know. So, but I, I discovered that uh, at the later part of my life, I, I discovered that exam is not a true test of brilliancy. So don't let anybody put you down. Failure is not the end. It is just uh, an opportunity for you to to pick the same process up again and do it in a better way. So. Whether you are failed, whether you are failing currently, gear up. It doesn't matter. You you can still attain that position. You know, you can attain that future you have been dreaming about for a long time. You know, and then for for you girls, don't let anybody put you down. You 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 are not supposed to end in the kitchen. You know, don't think uh, you cannot do or you cannot study as much as guys are doing you you can see in our society today notable women in notable positions so um i believe in equality of education for a girl child you know so don't so don't see yourself as inferior to boys you are very important too you can read you can be as intelligent you can be as good as your male counterparts the opportunity is there for you as the opportunity is there for boys too. So don't let anybody look down on you. You are not a second class citizen of our society when it comes to education. You, 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 you are eligible. You, are, you have the right to study as much as boys studies. So um, let me say that um, in your journey in life, the most important thing you need is uh, your, your absolute decision and don't, don't stop dreaming that is very important don't stop dreaming you know then when you dream you put action to your dream and then the sky is just the beginning for you i i was asked to tell my stories but i believe that stories um 